let's start settling in. So coming into a comfortable position for your sit. By the way, I might just remind us that, um, you know, it's fine to meditate lying down. We can also meditate standing up. I recently did a, a, a retreat where one guy really couldn't sit and he did most of the meditation walking just fine. I'm going to assume for the most part we're sitting. So find your seat. Yeah. Find your seat. And start settling in, settling down. If you're able to, see if you can gently allow your spinal column to expand slightly by itself, as if there's a column of steam rising up, the column of the spine, as if the cranium, the, the top of the head, is something like a parachute catching an updraft, just inflating a little bit, rising a little bit. At the same time, let, let yourself be aware of your seat. See if you can feel the two sitting bones. And if you'd like to, I invite you to very gently at your own speed rock. So again, see if you want to, if it's nice, if you're free and if it feels good to just rock gently backward and forward. A few times, just feeling your way, getting to know where the center is, where the vertical plumb line is. We're just feeling that central axis. And the movements can become very small and subtle, just kind of nudging forward and backward, like some pendulum that's going slower and slower and smaller and smaller and coming to rest in the middle. Yeah. Once again, just tune into the seat, feel the connection with the seat and with the earth. while feeling that, again sense the cranium, the top of the skull, gently rising like that parachute in the updraft, feel it again. And while that lift is happening spontaneously, there's no effort here, just let the lift happen by itself. While that's going on, let the jaw relax. Let the jaw be slack. 
let it settle, sink, slide even forward and down, maybe an eighth of an inch. And as it, as it releases, feel the softness that comes into the throat. So jaw is released, throat is soft, and let the tongue relax. Let it rest like a damp leaf on the floor of the mouth. The tongue is an amazingly complex and active muscle. It does so much for us. Just feel how good it can be to let it rest. This is great because this area, throat, tongue, jaw, it's right around the brain stem and just bringing some conscious ease to this part of the equipment of the nervous system can be very nice for it. You might find the shoulders relax as well and the arms, let them be limp like old ropes. Hands are soft. And, um, you know, if we are sitting with the back free, it's amazing how much ease we can find in a state of balance. If we're balanced, if we find that balance, the whole rib cage can, can relax, can dangle like a, like an old wicker basket, hanging at ease. The midriff, the belly, warm and soft. Feel a kind of flow of melting warmth that comes all the way down the body, out of the soft throat, the soft, easy shoulders, flowing, melting warmly down, all the way down through chest and belly, into hips, upper legs, lower legs, feet. Body at rest, upright for most of us, but at rest. What can happen here is that out of the state of rest, a deeper, clearer awareness emerges by itself. When we sort of trust rest, ease, it's as if a, another property of this kind of calm comes forth by itself, which is an easy awareness, somehow clear. We can feel and sense body sensation in a fresh way where our body is in contact with other 
things like support beneath us in the lower body where it's in contact with clothing sensing the warmth and maybe comfort of clothing and the air on our bare skin we can receive the soundscape more clearly. Sounds nearby, maybe in the room or in the building. Maybe there's some background long duration sounds we can detect. Maybe there's individual sounds that are arising. And further afield, outside of the building, maybe there's more remote sounds. For many of us, there's some amount of inner ear sound we can detect. Can be, can be like a hiss or a hum, or both even. See if you can maybe also get a sense that all sound is arising in the space, a single space of the soundscape. So as we're open to sound, we can also be open to the space in which sounds arise. we can quite naturally allow the movement of the breath to start to register in our awareness as well. Yeah, soft, easy movement of the breath. Let it be as it wishes to be. See if you can watch the breaths rolling through somewhat like ocean swells coming through. As if, perhaps as if watching something like a harbour wall where the swells rise and fall rise and fall. Maybe you can even get a little sense that each breath is part of a vastness. You know, like a wave on the ocean. Part of the, the vast atmosphere. Uh, 
and intimately connecting us with the great atmosphere of this planet. Each breath is a kind of intimate meeting with this great Mother Earth and its atmosphere. Of course, um, it's quite natural that thoughts may come. And any time we notice that they have and, and uh, we've become aware of it, let yourself recognize that your, your thoughts have been present and maybe just pause out whether they've been in the form of talk or image, or both. And you can use a little simple retroactive label, talk, or image, or if appropriate, talk and image. Just acknowledging, ah yes, that's what's been going on, fine. And fine also to have recognized it and come back to being here. And then we can come back to the breath with gratitude for the breath. Gratitude for our practice. Gratitude that we're able to do this most wonderful thing of being still and quiet. Another image you might try out with the breath is of something like a tidal pool that rises and falls, rises and falls as each swell comes and goes. And if any difficult emotion, uncomfortable emotion comes up, see if you can track it, find it in the body, maybe in the midriff or the chest, 
and be very soft around it. Soften you, soften you, your body and your awareness around any discomfort that may arise for any of us from time to time. See if you can send yourself some love, give yourself some love. Gently coaxing the mind back to the breath when we realize it's wondered. And letting the breath become a real home. Like a, a, a soothing place. Let that movement of the breath be kind of like a internal massage.
Let yourself taste the shared stillness. Last few minutes, how beautiful it is to feel part of a group of people being still together. Okay, so when you're ready, um, you can maybe just bring some movement, wiggle, wiggle your toes, your fingers, open the eyes if they've been closed and move any way that feels good. <laughs> 